Billy McConnell was on pole position for the Pirelli National Superstock race at Cadwell Park. But it was a great start from Tim Neave, who got the whole shot into turn one. But immediate drama as Ash Beach crashed and knocked Rich Kerr through onto the grass. Phil Crow joining him. A couple of other moments further back as well, as one or two riders went down over at the gooseneck. It left three riders out front with Tim Neave leading Joe Talbot second and Billy McConnell in third. Lovely move from Talbot, moved him up into P1, down into Mansfield corner. The youngster looking for his first win in the National Superstock Championship. Then some drama on the exit of turn one into turn two. Francis was taken down after being clipped by Matty Whelan. And then at the very same corner, there was going to be more drama to come. Tim Neave made his move on Joe Talbot with Billy McConnell running close. And as they made their way round and passed the start, finish straight again, McConnell eager to get through on Joe Talbot, made contact with the Honda rider. He went down and Billy McConnell was given the equivalent of a ride through penalty. McConnell knew this and he went straight through on Tim Neave to try and build the lead and cut the deficit down. Tim Neave probably at this point wasn't aware that he was already the race winner, but he knew it by the time the chequered flag came out. McConnell in the end went across the line in first, but with the penalty was for Tim Neave wins from Dan Limford and Alistair Seeley.